Rebecca, you're supposed to be waiting for me back at the hotel. <sighs> yeah. Well, thank goodness I didn't. You, you can't put the flash drive into the tabloid office. Then everyone will know that, that Gwen and I outed Ethland a as a Bennett to the tabloid. Mm -hmm. Good point. We paid you a fortune so you'd keep our secret. So did everyone else on blackmailing. <gasps> JT, how can you betray us, all your, all your victims, that way? I'm a cad with no conscience. Okay, now that we're clear on that, will you please help me up? Of course. You bitch! Oh, I am going to kill you for that! Well, you watch the hair. I just combed it out. Oh, you're going to rip oh, out your hair! I'm going to give it to you! Give me that! Give me that! No, 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 Rebecca, no deal! I've got to get out of town before the dirt I dug up ends up in print. When people realize I took their money and still expose them, I'll end up a big and not the good kind. No, my name. Chad, are you ready to forsake all others for Whitney from this day forward? Uh, yes, Father. I am. Not exactly. What? what? What do you mean? I mean, that was trouble brewing. Big trouble. Tell me what. Before Chad and Whitney exchange rings, if there is anyone here who knows any reason why these two should not be joined in holy matrimony, let them speak now or forever hold their peace. No! 